Hey, welcome to this. All right, so picture this. The year is 2024, it's New Year's Day, and you think, why not install Windows 7 on an old computer I have? Well, that's exactly what we're doing in today's video. We are installing Windows 7 Home Premium on an old Asus Fire X1430 with 8GB of RAM and AMD E350 CPU. Yeah, it just took me a while to remember that. 500 gigs of HDD storage and an AMD Radeon integrated graphics card or whatever. So yeah, I'm currently downloading a Windows 7 ISO right now, so I'll see you on the computer. Alright, here we go, we're on the screen. Let's boot up the computer and spam that F12 key. Let's go into SanDisk, because that is what I am using. And here we go, we are in Ventoy. So let's boot into Windows 7. Yep. And our only option is Windows Setup EMS Enabled. Let's go for it. So I just decided to try with a whole bunch of other things before eventually landing on Ventoy. I had a spare Ventoy drive, so I just I had a spare Ventoy drive with all these ISOs, so I just decided to use it. Anyway, starting Windows. Install now. This mouse is loud. It's really loud. Anyway, setup is starting. Oh my gosh, this mouse sensitivity is a bit. All right, there we go, that's a bit better. Let's click I accept, next. Custom, let's go shift F10 so that I can load disk part and go list this just to check. Yup. Just go clean. Disk part succeeded in cleaning the disk. Here we go. Disk zero, unallocated, next. Next, oh there we go, okay. So it's just a bit slow. Anyway, I'll just leave this recording and I'll go do other things. Bye. It's doing its first checks. It took 15 minutes to do that? Wow, this thing is slow. Oh, here we go, here we go, okay. Whale. Whale PC. I do not want to name it Whale PC. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. I was just going to name it Aspire X1430. No password. Sorry. And I have my product cage. It's on my phone some. Oh, there it is. Alright. I'm going to move my phone over here so that you don't see my key. Because, yeah, this is a legitimate 
the certificate of authenticity and I do not want this to be late. Should not have typed in the key because, oh yeah, it takes forever. To go shut and restart the computer. I just do not want to deal with this. I do not want to deal with it taking forever. All right, let's put it in a better position. There we go, starting windows. All right, we're back here. Oh, there we go. There we go. So. Yeah, I don't care if it's way old PC. It's so important even though there is no update. Yeah. I'm gonna add that key later. Now it's time for drivers, which is fantastic. Welcome! It's in a really bad resolution. It should be in 1080p, but oh well, we don't have graphics drivers. So, I need drivers. Where are my drivers? Are they, on, are they on this USB drive? Does this have mass storage drivers? I think it does. I think Windows 7 does come with mass storage drivers. Okay, here we go. Here we go, we're setting up personalized rubbish. Windows 7 most beautiful operating so they, oh my gosh windows 7 and look at this i have never seen this on windows 7 before first of january 2024 it might be out by like the second or the third this video but what what this is not ventoy this is this is my extras drive that i just have plugged in Yeah, it's way old PC. I have to fix that. But whatever. There we go. Now it shows up properly. Do I have? Oh. I do not have drivers on this. Well, let's put them on. Let's switch the input over to HDMI one. Here we go. Let's sign in and plug in the drive but I plug it in the USB 3 port I think I do need it plugged in for, for to actually you know produce an output All right here we go and we also have a whole bunch of um, files on here other drivers. I'm just gonna drag this in here. No, cancel. I, I clicked move instead of. Oh, flip. Okay. Let's check the carry over. It did. It did. right into apply to all right into okay now we wait for files to transfer Oh, there we 
we go, there we go. There we go. Ugh. I can't reach. Right, here we go. So let's first get network drivers. Date created in 0101 2024. Here we go, we're installing the real tech. And while that's installing, we're gonna install the AMD Catalyst drivers. to edit. <sighs> Installation complete. Oh, warnings occurred. What is this? I don't care. Finish. Now let's see if I can go into personalize. And oh, I think I might need a reboot. Let's reboot. <laughs> Oh, I think it might not be working because of because the screen resolution. It doesn't go up to ten eighty. shooting and I've been recording for an hour. I mean, on this installation, I've not seen that. And yay, we're actually installing drivers! Probably because I was away for like half an hour and it timed out or something, I don't know. Well, I copied it over to my C drive and yeah, 
we're currently installing a whole bunch of rubbish. I've been trying to get Aero to work and it said this. Not sure you can really read it, but whatever. I'm just going to get a better resolution here. Currently installing display driver. Yeah, I am going to remove the AMD. Oh! Well, now we got a green check mark, baby. Finish. Oh, nice. Yes, reboot. Oh my gosh, it's 1080. Do we have Aero? Do we have Aero? Do we have Aero? Yes or no? No, we do not. But that's all right. We unfortunately didn't... We do not have sound, unfortunately. this episode i hope you enjoyed it and if you did make sure to leave a like and subscribe down below so that you do not miss any future content like this one so that's going to be it for me for now and yeah bye